much. Hi, my name's Tom. My school, my my uh, show is about going to boarding school. Oh, yes, exactly. <laughs> Correct response. Um, I've been geeking up north. I'm what's known up there as a posh twat. <laughs> all my friends, you'll know them all. That oh, mate, mate, legends, yeah. Legends, mate, legends, good chat, mate, yeah, good chats, yeah, yeah, legends, legends, we know, them? yeah, yeah, absolute legends. We don't call each other by our first names because that might suggest we have any other emotion towards each other than banter. <laughs> so what we do is we call each other by our nicknames, and our nicknames are either abbreviations or play on words of our surnames or stuff we're known to have done. We're all called like JC and Jonas and Wakey and Blez and Bunty and Fuckhorse. <laughs> Say what you want about fuck horse, follows through a dare. <laughs> they all work for Deloitte now in the financial sector, all talking double and triple negatives. How's your job? Oh mate, I don't not love numbers. <laughs> <laughs> it's a couple of JCs and fuck horses in the audience, I think, aren't there? <laughs> Yeah, mate, get on it, legends, banter. <laughs> we used to play rugby. Rugby was great. Rugby was invented at private school. Rugby was invented in the town of rugby at the school of rugby. <laughs> by an imaginative man called William Webb Ellis. And what he was doing is he was playing football and he was losing. So get this for white male privilege. <laughs> he decided to pick up the ball and start running with it. And all his mates went, oh, uh, uh, Webby Ellis, Webster, mate, WWE, <laughs> mate. It's handball? He went, no, no, it's not handball, actually, it's a new game. Went, what? No, it's handball. No, no, it's a new game, totally new game. I just invented it, it's the best game in the world. It's like the time he picked up the cricket stumps and invented bomb sticks. No. <laughs> no, it's totally new game, it's the best game in the world. He, he named it after the place he was born and raised. Just bearing in mind, there's a lot of different place names in England. Different reality, you could very much be meeting up every Saturday for an 80 minute game of Milton Keynes. <laughs> What are you doing on Sunday? Just going down the park for a game of Touch Swindon? <laughs> you've been to the Lake District, Japan could very well be hosting the 2019 Cock and Mouth World Cup. <laughs> then they went, OK, right, what's the, what are the rules? And he made up the most batshit set of rules you've ever heard. Right, so basically there's two teams, one ball, one pitch, one ref. You've got forwards, you've got backs. You, uh, you're trying to get your forwards and backs to go forward, while the other forwards and backs are trying to make you go backwards. Both backs and forwards can run backwards and forwards, but they can only pass backwards. Any back or forward while running back and forward can kick the ball forward, but in order for the other backs and forwards to pick it up, they have to be further back than the original back and forward was when he kicked it forward. The back or forward while running back and forward takes the ball out sideways, the forwards throw the ball sideways to the forwards and throw it back to the backs, so then try and go forward. If a back or forward while running back and forward drops the ball forward, play continues forward, allow the other forwards and backs a chance to go forward, but if they don't go forward, play goes back to the original back and forward when they drop it forward. If you draw it backwards, it's totally fine. <laughs> Webster, it's not uncomplicated, is it? How do you stop each other going backwards and forwards? Oh, her, you beat the living fuck out of each other. <laughs> I hope there's not a complicated point scoring system. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Tom Horton. I'm on the Pleasant 810. Uh, that's what I go to school for. Thank you very much. All the best. Hooray! Right, Tom Horton. Lovely.